Hi, I'm Craig Summers, naturopath and nutritionist. I'm here with my friend, Peter Ragnar. And our topic today is a plant called Bacopa. Peter, I know you have experience with this plant. Will you please share it with our viewers? Certainly. Bacopa is um, another one of those brain herbs that's been recently discovered and uh, has gotten the attention of modern researchers, but actually it goes back a long ways. It's something that is found in the subtropical areas of India and it became uh, well known to Ayurvedic medical practitioners. One of the things they understood was that the ancient shamans had used this particular herb, which again is an aquatic type of plant, and they used it to sharpen their memory. Now, how well did it sharpen their memory? Well, it is said that they used it in order to remember certain religious writings. In other words, they could remember a text 900 pages long. In other words, double the size of this book and then recite it back word for word. Now that obviously is a very impressive memory feat and that was the power of retention, mental retention that Bacopa grants the user. Well wow, that's really incredible and I understand you've been taking it yourself. I take it every morning. And, and what's your personal experience with it? Well, one of the things uh, I've noticed is that it increases my ability to retain memory and it improves the short-term memory as well. Uh, there are a number of studies, modern studies on it and these studies, one of the studies was done back in 1996 at the Brain Research Conference and what they did, they took two groups of people yeah and they had them memorize and learn material that one group it took 10 days to learn. The second group that had the Pakota was able to retain and learn that material in six days. So this would definitely be helpful for people who have short-term memory loss. Uh, that's another one of the studies that they've been doing. Uh, uh, about 10 years later, in 2006, there's an article in the Journal of Psychiatry uh -huh. that shows how it improves short-term memory loss. So, you know, people go out of the house, they forgot, where did I put my keys? Did I bring my keys or did I bring my wallet? Things like that that seem to be incidental to modern life. Well, it improves that faculty tremendously. And I think a lot of us can use that. How do you use it? How do you take it, Peter? I take it, uh, it just takes a little bit of a pinch. And I take that little pinch of it and I put it on my tongue. And just like that. Now, what they've discovered too is that it takes about eight weeks to 12 weeks to get the maximum amount of mental retention. So you notice something initially right from the start. I notice it, uh, I get a little buzz out of it in the morning. I, my brain becomes so lucid, so clear, and it continues to build day after day, week after week. So it's a, it's a very, very powerful and uh, beautiful thing that we have discovered, even though the ancients discovered it for, probably thousands of years ago and it's been sort of a ear-whispered secret. But yes, well, modern science often takes time to catch up, but um, I was looking through some medical studies on this plant and, and found actually a lot of them and um, now I'm going to show them to our viewers. A meta-analysis of nine randomized controlled trials on the cognitive effects of Bacopa extract found that 437 people showed improved cognition. The study concluded that Bacopa has the potential to improve cognition, particularly speed of attention. In 2002, 
a randomized, double-blind, placebo-controlled study was published showing the efficacy of Bacopa. There were 76 adults between the ages of 40 and 65. The results showed that taking Bacopa had a significant positive effect on the retention of new information. Another randomized double-blind placebo-controlled study published in 2012 concluded that Bacopa can improve attention, cognitive processing, and working memory in senior citizens. Promising research suggests that Bacopa can be of help to those people with age-related memory impairment, including those with conditions such as dementia and Alzheimer's disease. In Ayurvedic medicine, Bacopa has also been used to treat epilepsy, stress, allergies, irritable bowel syndrome, and more. Looking through the medical literature, one can find studies done on both humans and animals where Bacopa has been used to treat a variety of conditions. These include anxiety and depression, bronchitis and asthma, gastrointestinal disorders, hypothyroidism, Parkinson's disease, schizophrenia, attention deficit disorder in children, and more. The research is ongoing. Therapeutic doses of Bacopa have not been associated with any dangerous side effects. However, it is not advised to take larger doses than recommended. The usual dose is 300 milligrams of extract per day for a period of 12 weeks. It is known that Bacopa has been used safely in India for at least the last several hundred years and perhaps even thousands of years.